y'all it's your girl jenny and e and we are going to react to the rest of the daryl brooks um, interrogation so let's just do it let's see what daryl talking about tonight what you got going on daryl you always in some shit <laughs> daryl right so we're not quite there yet. I'm trying to figure out if I've got all my facts right first. So this wasn't a three-way call. Let's back up to there for a second. How did you come to meet her in the? How did you come to meet her in the park? So y'all not can't y'all can't tell me nothing. Well, you were driving. You, yeah, that that's funny because Daryl just knows. He knows. He's like, come on, just say it so that I can deny it. <laughs> just tell me what I did. I mean, I know what I did, but I just want you to say it so that I can start denying it. Pronto. On delay, on delay. <laughs> you are no more than what y'all say, though. And that's what, that's what has me like, like, why should... I cooperate when there's no cooperation with me. Nothing, nothing I'm saying is gonna help me. I mean, like it doesn't make sense to the. We're trying to gather the facts. Yep, man, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I mean, I'm not saying it doesn't make sense. You know, okay, what you guys are doing. I'm just saying, I don't want to get railroaded. I'm saying, Daryl, um, never accept food <laughs> in the interrogation room. <laughs> Don't do, why would they feed you if they didn't have something on you? Like, you know, like this. that's why they are feeding you. And it, this is also going to show the, the jury that you are heartless beast because here you are grubbing down this here food after what you just did. You like this, <laughs> this is all just a trick. It's like, Hey, don't here. What you, what would you like? Run over here and get you a sandwich. <laughs> No, I am. No, y'all not telling me what's really going on. But we're not, we're not getting the full truth either. I know. But I, and what I was saying you was, didn't I didn't. An issue. So when you left, you guys met in the car. You didn't walk there. She if got I, in the if car. I tell you everything that happened, and y'all gonna be straight up with me about what I'm facing. That's all I want to know. Well, I don't want to know understand. anything else. I don't need you guys to tell me, <laughs> hey man, this is this, that is that. This is this. I just want to know. Just, just, so just, I don't know just, the entire... just, you know what you've done. They done told you they found the car. <laughs> what else do you need them to tell you? You want them to show you the photograph of you in the car? Ramming through these people? Is that what you want to see? Will that make you happy, my precious Daryl? Oh my God, this guy. He's so weird. Just be honest with me. Just be keep it real, baby. <laughs> I thought we had something. I thought we had something special. You brought me this cheeseburger and I thought we had something special. Just for the fact, just for the fact that, like I said, my my girls. Yeah, no, I got you. I don't know the entirety right now. So while I'm here. Um, a couple of officers talked to Erica. Um, I'm not the only one working on it, so I don't know everything. I got to report baby. to a boss. That's so I don't know about. exactly everything that's going to be yet. And that part's not a lie. I don't I know do. exactly everything that's going to be yet. I'm just trying to figure out to get to that point where I can have a clear idea and call who I need to call to get some of the information to find that all out. I'm trying to get a clear <laughs> idea of what really happened regarding you and her. Uh -huh. And when you drove away, where you were going. Yeah, where did you where go? Did you not know? Where'd you go? You know what I'm saying? Just say it. Because right now, I don't know everything. Wow. Because I'm out here and, and they're out there. Oh, walk show. Right, and I'm like, how long do I got to sit in these? Where, where are we at? Ski go. How long do I got to sit in this jail before I can call somebody, get a phone call, let my, you know, let my daughters know, hey, man, I don't know what's going on. 
but it's, it's good to hear your voice. Are y'all okay? Yeah, we're trying to, we're trying we're to get to, to that point, Darrell, but. What, your daughters are fine. They're the same place that they was before. It's not like they were right up underneath of you all the time anyway. I, I don't know what you're talking about, Daryl. Daryl act like he had his children. <laughs> like his children live with him and he raised his children. <laughs> I said, what about the kids? You know, because it's the children that matter. I mean, not the ones I ran over, but the ones that I made. Allegedly. Oh my gosh. The question I asked you when you left. Where were you going? Did you know or did you not know? Were you just mad and you left? Where were you going when you initially drove off? That's... Yeah, where you did you to, go? If you didn't know where the hell you were going, you didn't have an idea, or you didn't have a particular destination in mind, you know, so be it. Maybe we've been talking a couple hours. You want to sit and eat a minute? I wish they had some Tylenol. I've been trying to fight this pain, man, since... They might, I don't know. Oh, the pain? Yeah, they show I, I, I don't know. Did you ask them? Oh yes. So they don't? They just said they'll see. Just saying the word pain just took me to what's happening in the hospital right now. Like, while he's in this interrogation, what chaos is happening inside of the hospital? With these kids is in there just fighting for their little lives while he in here drinking his soda, pulling his little mask down. Oh, are you worried about your safety, is you? <laughs> safety first. Daryl. Oh, my God. Just get under the table at least. At least. <laughs> we'll see. It hurt worse now than it did yesterday. Or last night, rather. I bet. Yeah, it's going to be sore. It's definitely sore. There's no doubt about that. Oh, my God. Take a break and see if we uh, can round up some time on what I mean. Yeah, we can see if we can. How about we see if we want me to see if I can find some? Yeah, I just wanted. To... Let me see if I can find some. It's so many things going through my mind right now. The pain, the you I'm not know. even. I didn't even know. She called the, the word. She didn't call the like cops or yeah, someone else did. I know you said <laughs> you lost <laughs> your phone, else did. or you didn't yeah. know where you were. I like how you put that in there. Oh, she didn't call the cops. <clears throat> Somebody else did. <clears throat> <laughs> Oh, she didn't call the cops. When she was gone, she wasn't worried about you no more. It was everybody else who encountered you right after that. It went dead and now you don't know where it is. If we find it so we know it's yours, can get it back to you? I know you said it's cracked, but... No, well, it, it, the screen out. is cracked, but it has a... Uh, I don't think the, it went all the way to the what's glass. The post, so we know it's yours and if we can um, return it. It, it, doesn't, it doesn't have a number code. It has, you have to... Can you draw it? Do it with with that. Can you draw it? It's dead. It's not even going to turn off. Well, <laughs> yeah, but we don't want to give it to somebody else. We don't want to give it to somebody else. That chuckle. It's that chuckle that gives you away, Daryl. I mean, they don't. It's not a code. It's like a, it's like a drawing. <laughs> can you draw it? <laughs> like, can you draw it or no? <laughs> Quit trying to be cute. And just <laughs> get up, up under this jail. Get up, up under this jail. He under the jail now, though, y'all. He under there. Down below, down below. It's cold in there. And the echo, I bet. I bet it's an echo. That's what it look like on the TV shows. It be sounding like it's an echo in the jail. The prison. It's a seven. He's going to be in there forever. It's typically. It's like, the phone is dead, so... Like I said, we can charge it. I don't want somebody else to no, no, say, no, no, no. oh, that's my phone. Even though we're giving your property to somebody else. Wait a minute. So that sounded like y'all got my phone. <laughs> if we find it. I didn't say we had it. I said we... Yes, we got your phone, baby. So give us that there code so we can see what's in it. And the way you acting is making me feel very, very excited that something's in the phone that we're going to need. Look at him. He like, wait. You sound like y'all got my phone. Daryl, yes, of course we have your phone. We have your phone. We have the car. We have the photos. <laughs> we just want to play around in your phone and really look through and see all of the stuff that makes Daryl so special. Find it. Mr. Seven. 
right, so in that direction? Okay. All right. So this way down? Okay. No, I don't know if they have it now, if, but if we find you know it, you don't have it. it so it's, like it's in my back pocket, baby. Well, thanks <laughs> be in somewhere in the area of that house. I got my phone. I mean, your phone. For me to look forward to, but it's like <laughs> this woman, man. And I love her to death, man. I want her to be my wife, man, but <laughs> I just wish Girl. somebody could tell her that. Ain't like, nobody. <laughs> I wish somebody could really tell her, like, man, this dude love you, man. Why are you doing this to this guy, man? He literally wants to marry you. 16 years, man, off and on. I'm not going to go mess with nobody else, man. That, <laughs> that's the person that I want to be with. But I'm not going to continue to be the scapegoat because you want to drink. And, and when you know I don't, be, you're making it seem like I just beat up on you. Like I'm just like you're a punching bag or something. Amen. I don't wake don't up and be like, oh, like bitch, I'm going to hit you. Or I'm gonna hit. Like what? Do y'all recall the way that Daryl, our uh, precious, precious Daryl, was having a stare down contest with the judge. Do you guys remember that? It was insane, the look on his face. You seen that, right? And, but he talking about, hey, you know, it ain't like I was beating on that girl. That, you know, I wish somebody could tell her I want to marry her so she don't testify. <laughs> I wish somebody would just tell her she's the one for me. Even though I done said all this stuff about how I ain't paying her no mind and she mad because I ain't paying her no mind. I ain't even like her like that. He said all that inside of the same interrogation. <laughs> Daryl don't know what he want to do. But he know he want to get up out of here. Mm -hmm. But nope. They got you. They got you in the spider web. Your web of lies. <laughs> like almost like I'm demonized here like yeah <laughs> I'm not saying you're a demon no yeah. not you not 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 your yeah. opinion, man. I, but it's just it's just I me. feel that way because you're trying to in the world trying to just ah I, I know you heard that oh my god uh okay so right. so, so Daryl is trying to play injury from when they tackled him I guess in the in the yard, so they trying like he got this injury. This man would do anything. Fucking hurt. Sure. I know you heard that. I heard it. In check. We're gonna go check with them. Maybe they'll listen to us a little bit better. Fuck. Want to check? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Give us a minute. Ah. Uh, see what we got. Dude, they it gotta how, how, it gotta be something wrong, man. He is so. Bad. It gotta be something wrong then because my shoulder popped. You know, my shoulder popped. It's gotta be something wrong. Now, might I point out again what is happening while he's here in this interrogation room? There are, the, the, the hospital is just like running rampant with victims fighting for their lives. Children. While he's in here complaining about his shitty little shoulder, they should just grab that arm and just pull it right off. <laughs> just take it and just pop. Just pull it. Just pop. Pull it right off. And then be like, there. Now you ain't got to worry about it no more. It won't pop no more because it ain't there no more. How in the hell does it... Sometimes sprains will pop too. Yeah, but why is it hurting like this and they say there's nothing? Because sprains can actually be more painful than oh a break. Oh my God. So whatever what they got, whatever they did, they did, it hurt so bad. Mm -hmm. keep look, look, look. He's trying to get like, oh, they attacked me. I, you know, they wrestled me to the ground and and now they got to let me go. <laughs> because they, cause they hurt me. <laughs> They hurt me. And so now you must release me. And that's how it works inside my Daryl head. That's how Daryl thoughts work. The food, why don't you keep the food in the soda and move back in the Ah. 
A mischievous little creep. Soon as they close this door, oh, oh, let me see what you got over here. And go trying to read this guy's paper. And if you think that they didn't leave that there on purpose, you lost your mind. They left that shit there on purpose. They knew he was going to do that, and they also knew they were going to be watching on the camera. <laughs> oh, the fun of being a detective. <laughs> <laughs> he gonna try to use the phone. I thought your shoulder was hurting. I thought your shoulder was hurting, Daryl. Oh my God, who's he gonna call? I did not this is my first i'm watching this like in real time so i did not know that that was that let's see that let's see that little piece again where he you know tries to hurry up and scurry that's hilarious watch how he puts it down and then goes back to his pain position uh, oh oh look, look, look. look at this little creeper he's such a creeper <laughs> Look at it's y'all figure he like how you use this phone. Oh, that door gonna open up. Look, look, look. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, this pain is pain is so good. Have you do you not watch any crime shows? How do you not know that there's a camera in here? Like it, this is people make fun of people like myself who love true crime things right but guess what we all know Th there's a freaking camera in the interrogation room like that how do you not know that there's a camera in there like how do you not notice that or even not just notice just know just generally know even if you can't see it why would they not have a camera in there why would they not it's not a restroom <laughs> The only place they can't legally put a camera is in the bathroom. Does it? Every place else, there's a camera, baby. Oh my God, he is so weird. And you know they laughing inside. Yeah. Like, this fool. I think we got that title off. We'll be right with you. Oh my God. I bet he didn't want to watch that part. I bet he didn't want to watch that part. He's like, oh my God, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. I can't believe they they didn't trust me and they, they watched me on camera while I was being deceptive. <laughs> what if it wasn't me driving? What if it wasn't you? What if it was my mom's trip? Mm -hmm. But I wasn't driving. Mm -hmm. What if it was you? What if it wasn't you? Mm -hmm. Who else would it be? The boogeyman. That's what I'm. That's what I'm asking. Not not asking you. Who else would it be? I'm just asking. What if I knew? Mm -hmm. Would I be asked to give that information? Well, like I said, we're here together. Truth. So if somebody else was driving that car, yeah, I would want to know who that car is so we go talk to that person. But a huge part of that is going to be your honesty with it. Right, right, right. Now I was just asking because you just ask, you know. Oh, the levels here. I wonder whom he was going to try to throw under this here bus. I'm so intrigued. 
I'm intrigued right now. I, I didn't know. I didn't even know about this. <laughs> I just dove right into the funniness of his trial. It didn't even occur to me about this part. And so one of y'all, somebody in the comments asked me about the interrogation. And I was like, huh. <laughs> there is an interrogation that happens first, isn't there? So I check it out and oh my gosh, he's so consistent. Oh, you know, you, you've already figured out you're not, a, you're not an idiot. You're not a dumb man. You're a smart guy. Right. I, I see that. <laughs> you know that we've been working on this. Right. Why I'm here. That's <laughs> why I'm in this position that I'm in right now. Because I'm smart. <laughs> you brought that up where you don't want to see anybody where their nose. I'll show you in a minute. Oh, okay. You don't want to um, see anybody get hurt. Or sorry, you don't want to see yeah, anybody he... get charged for something they didn't do. But you already brought up too that if somebody did something that they should be held accountable for it. Yep. And that you're willing to accept responsibility. What's going on? If it's Can I show you something? You look like you gotta film me or something. No, no, I'm not filming. Are hey, you? That's you? Nah, I ain't got no, um, it look like whoever. It look like Gray. Right there. I can see your face. <laughs> nah, that's not me. That's not you. That's not me. No, no, that's not me. Remember, though, he's right. According to him, he's he actually is telling the truth because remember, during the trial, he kept saying, I'm not Daryl. <laughs> I'm not Daryl Brooks. Stop calling me that. That's not who I am. Even though this right here is a photo of the person who's sitting in the chair, which is you. Forget the name Daryl Brooks. Is this person in this photo is you. <laughs> it's the same face as you, sir. In your mom's car, which is, I mean, a hell of a coinky dink. Do you have a twin brother? <laughs> that's not you. No, I don't. I don't. Darrell. That's uh, Darrell. Hey, that's you. That's you, Darrell. Hey, it's Daryl. <laughs> Why you say it like that, man? Because we talked about the honesty piece. You keep telling me that you you tell you tell the truth when you did do something. You it's take responsibility when you do do something. There's your mom's car again. Look at Daryl. There's your mama car, mom's car again. Uh huh. There it is. Next to a child, which I know you care a lot about, children. Next to a child, from someone like Yeah. Uh huh. It's mm. mom's car. Oh, yeah. I was just asking him about my, um, about. That's your mom's car going on with that. that we took the key for from you. So. Oh, Daryl, you gonna get it? You can't tell me at this point I'm playing any games anymore. I didn't. I didn't say you was playing games from the get go. Well, you felt Just like last night. Totally no, last night I felt like it wasn't as it wasn't you know, as you fluid were. as you wanted. No, it wasn't the flu. It was. Look at that! Look at that! How come you ain't complaining about your shoulder no more, Daryl? <laughs> Notice he forgot all about his shoulder. He was in so much pain, trying to sneakily get on the phone, and it went right back to his pain. And now he's done. Forgot all about his pain. He's like. Shit. How far down under the jail am I going again? I'm going to show a picture of a poor little kid next to the car. Just, I, 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 knew, as much as I, to I knew that y'all knew more than what y'all was saying. And I felt like last night with that whole, you know, them coming in. See how he said y'all knew more than y'all was saying? Not that y'all had me in here for more than what y'all was saying it was. Y'all knew more than y'all was saying. Th you see what I'm saying? Like, that's a confession right there. Like, oh my gosh. I mean, the way they did it, because I'm sitting there in the thing and I'm watching them walk past, like, what in the hell? 
And seeing that, I just felt like, okay, y'all already know what y'all want to do, what y'all, you know what I'm saying? Y'all just won't. I didn't know what y'all want. It just seemed like y'all knew more than what y'all was going to tell me. It was more so like a, I felt like I was being railroaded to be like, okay, tell me this, but we already know over here what we going to do. We already know what we're going to do right yes, here. Darryl. We just want you to tell them yourself and say. It's like he wants them to explain themselves. <laughs> He's like, it's like, it's don't really, I don't understand, you know, like, how did we get here? Our relationship used to be so solid. <laughs> it feel like, it feel like y'all are betraying me. Like, Daryl, these is not your friends, okay? These are the guys with the shovel. <laughs> you did this and did that, so we can already justify what we already want to do. And it's like, I don't feel like that's fair. What time did you come out here? And it's like, car? I don't feel like What time did you head out from Milwaukee to Waukesha? I don't want to talk, man. I don't want to talk if, if I'm not getting no, I'm not getting nothing. I just showed you three pictures. Okay, man. you showed me pictures, but you're not telling me what I'm facing. You know what you're facing. I don't. That's the hope. You That's drove why down I keep a street, asking. You, still, you drove down a parade route. You got a pretty good idea what you're facing. You see what I'm saying? So now this is more stuff coming out, man. Yep. We, were, we told you we were looking for that explanation. And that's you. Uh, and all I'm saying is, look, all somebody got to do is just tell me what I'm facing. I'll tell you guys whatever you want to know. Okay, I is. said that three, four there times. It there it is. Okay, there it is. Now and you it's know. like, yo. Okay, now there it is. So, Darrell, what were you thinking when you went driving, driving through this parade? What am I facing? Murder. That's all <laughs> I want to know. Murder. I don't have no problem talking with you guys. You got people, you got people injured that had to go to the hospital. So they're saying I I injured somebody, or you're saying I injured yeah. somebody. Yeah. So I'm looking at what reckless endangerment. The very least, yeah. The very least. Yeah. People got hurt. That's reckless endangerment. I don't know exactly what they're gonna classify it. Yeah. People had legs broken. Endangerment's where you may have hurt somebody by your actions. You did hurt somebody by your actions. So what am I being charged with? That's what I'm trying to. I don't know exactly yet. So I don't know all of the details. <laughs> You're not gonna get that out of me. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm explaining to you. You're driving down there. You're, you're looking at people got hurt. People uh -huh. got some broken legs. And y'all saying that's me. I know yes, that's you. That's How you know that's you? Because I can recognize you. I can tell it's you. Yeah. And that's I'm your mom's at car. Your face. Which you had the key for. Unfortunately. I can ID you, Darrell. I'm just asking you to be honest about it. Be it don't live inside. What, what am I facing? What do you I'm think you're facing? I don't. I don't what do you think you're facing? What do you think hypothetically? I mean, you've been through this gamut before. Right. And y'all knew I was getting charged with this from day one. So why y'all couldn't just charge me and take me to county jail where y'all was going to take me, man? Daryl, because this is more fun. <laughs> because this is more fun, Daryl. That's why. If we just took you down there, we weren't going to get any kind of happy. We've, we've been all depressed, sitting here looking at all this crazy shit that you done did. And this is our only little bit of joy. You won't take it from us. Watching you sit here and pretend to, 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 to not be a lot. Uh, that phone thing was hilarious, I gotta tell you. That was the funniest part so far. It's him and that phone. Like, as soon as they walk out and he go, look at, look at them sheets of paper. What you got over here? <laughs> Ooh, a phone. Like, literally, they were gone for two minutes. And this nigga done touched everything in the room. <laughs> He's like a little kid. He done touched everything in the room. Because we because that, yes, you wanted me to tell him myself. That's that, basically what y'all yes, wanted me to do. You told us that there was reasons for everything. No, I'm saying, but... And I'm not I'm trying to piss y'all still. I'm not tripping with y'all. Because y'all been straight up. So I'm not... I'm not. But so I'm not saying... Y'all knew this. If y'all knew this already, why y'all just... And now, no, oh, they've been straight up, but then why y'all didn't tell me that you're contradicting yourself a lot here, Daryl? Are they being straight up or are they hiding stuff? Which one is it? Just didn't take me to why y'all just didn't do what y'all had to do. Here's, here's where you're at right now, and Darryl. it's like you take me through the runaround right to, to get me to do something that y'all already can I speak? No, that I did. Here's where you're at, okay? I'll, I'll tell you straight. Here's where you're at one of two people did this. And I mean that from a human perspective. There's a 
a God-fearing Christian who loves his kids and his mom that you say you are, and I want to believe you are, and in many ways you've presented yourself as, who went out, got in a fight with his girl, argument, whatever you want to call it, and went and, and just done screwed up. Or there's the malicious guy, the malicious guy who, who who's lied to me about his love for God, who's lied to me about his love for his mom. Yeah, that sounds about right. I think detective. I think it's that guy. Who's lied to me about his love don't, for don't his spin it. Don't spin it, man. It's one of those two people, man. It's, I'm just saying, don't what spin is it. it then? Don't spin it, man, because I'm not. Which one are you? Not gonna spin it, dude. Which guy are you? I'm the God fearing guy that you've been talking to since last night, man. Tell me the truth about. And you know that. Down and you know that. Then tell you me know the truth that. about driving down there. Tell road. me what I'm facing. I've just told you some of what you're facing. Some. Reckless endangerment. That's almost like saying I killed somebody. No, you want me to give you the entire That's case? You don't give it all. That's what he's trying to find out. He like shit. Did anybody die? Is this murder? If it's murder, I'm gonna lie. Just telling you now. If somebody died, I'm gonna lie about it. If nobody died, I'm still gonna lie about it. This thing ain't got the truth, ain't in you, Daryl. I'm not gonna do that. That's not what I'm asking. That's not what I'm asking. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Remember when I talk to you about perspective? Remember when I talk to you about perspective? Truth somewhere in the middle, all that. Yeah, that's how I see what you're saying. You got me doing all this and that, but y'all sit up here and come in here. We're not. I'm not blaming it on you guys. I'm not. But y'all sit up in here. The police do this every single time. Even when you try to be. How many times do you interact? Have you interacted with the police? Like, like, like y'all do this every time I get arrested. It's always the same thing. You asking me, where was I last night? And what did I do? I'm like, yeah, Daryl, it's... It's literally my job. Look, show me your guy. You, you try to you try to be straight up with him. You try to tell him the truth. You try to do all this and that, and they still railroad you. You're not every tell me the single truth. time. You're not trying to tell me the truth. It, it, not it's anymore. Not, it's not even no. It, it, it don't got nothing to do with that because I just told you I don't have a problem with telling you everything you want to know. I just wanted to have an idea. I, I just wanted to have an idea. That's all I said See, last you night. You know what I want to know. I and I, know and that's all happened. I said today. You know what happened. See, look, look. And now he has the information he wanted and that he wanted to know what is this really about. Now he knows and see how he's still not saying nothing. This is, this is the thing. And it's got, and it's got to be somebody else's fault at all times. What if somebody else was driving the car? Why y'all picking on me? You know, you know, like. It's everything is somebody else. Everything is somebody else and somebody else's fault. Okay, what am I being charged with? What are y'all going to charge me? What are y'all going to recommend? What are y'all going to do? Murder was the case that they gave me. You know what the... Well, he may not know. I don't know if he know um, the, the people died. For a judge, right? What do you want him to think? I mean, I don't... It's nothing I can have him think because y'all already basically said, okay, this is what happened. We just want you to... Tell us this, that this is what happened so we can just charge you with this, which, which we're going to charge you with. Are you the good guy that's screwed up or the evil guy that doesn't care? Oh, I definitely care. Okay, I definitely care. Truth. I definitely care. Why would you try to scare him like that? Just because I don't want to tell you something. Now I don't care. Now I'm the malicious guy. Now I'm this, now I'm that. Just because I don't want to talk. What other option? <laughs> you know the truth. We've been talking for a couple Y'all apparently know the truth too. But apparently. You when we came in, it was. He's telling on himself, like, constantly, but he thinks that he's giving them the runaround, but they're actually just chasing him in a circle on purpose. <laughs> he thinks here he's being deceptive, but they're, like, literally doing this entire thing is on purpose, like, because he's constantly saying things that are going to be used against him in the court of law. Was to get your you perspective on your night. side. Come on, Kirk, you knew this last night, man. This was, you I told knew you, this I last night. Yes, I told you. And you could have been like, yo, some people got hurt. We want to know what happened then. I didn't know enough details last night. There were people out there all night, all night, processing a scene the entire night until about, I don't know, noon today. Come on, man. Y'all knew, knew, knew all this, man. 
I didn't know everything. I'm telling you. I didn't know how far underneath the prison you was going to go back then. I, I just, I knew you were going underneath of it. I just didn't know how deep. What do you want me to tell you? I know now. <laughs> you can believe me if you want, but I, I got no I, reason why it was not, complete I'm chaos. Not saying, listen, I'm not saying you're lying. It was complete I'm, chaos. I'm not saying you're lying. So that's what took so long. I'm not. But you but know also, how it got to be that but way. Also, Tell us how it got see, to be I that way. I can't even get a word in. Because we're going round and around okay, and around, we're, around. We're, we're just going to keep going around and around here. And, and you're acting like you don't. I mean, it's acting like you don't know what these are. And, and you, you do. Dude is facing murder charges and still has not said I want to speak to my lawyer. Lawyer <laughs> this is the key word. I want to speak to a lawyer. I plead the fifth. Mm -mm. I plead the fifth. Mm -mm. <laughs> like he's steady in here talking. Wonder why he got twenty thousand years in jail. <laughs> Are you making it seem like I don't care? Like, I'm just this heartless type of person, dude. Well, if I can that even, way. Okay, that's fine. But look at my position. I've been in here for 24 hours. I haven't even gotten a shower, good sleep, my shower. Oh, my God. Wow. Look at it from my perspective. From my position. I've been in here 24 hours? A whole day? I shower? Still have this faith? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god you when you know what you just did jackson is like if he's still alive he's on like life support and they just know he ain't gonna make it like this is what's going on while he's in no in fact no jackson i don't think he probably didn't make it past the night oh my god this guy this dude Think about it from my, you gotta, you know, have a little empathy for me. Always for me. Shoulders fucked up. I haven't even got a phone call to even notify anybody, talk to my family whatsoever, not one time. I'm disappointed, Darrell. I'm disappointed too because you lied to me, Kurt. Because you lied to me. Talked about Nothing, what you listen. Want him to do with. Listen, and did I just say, do I don't have any problem telling you what happened. The only thing I'm saying is I feel like you were trying to railroad me by how you went about it. That okay, so now, okay. All right. You know what? I'm sorry. Daryl, you right. I'm wrong. You tall, I'm short. Now, now that we've gotten that out of the way. Can you just say what it is that you've done so we can go on and just scoot you underneath of this here prison? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. That's it. I'm not saying. Okay, we've I'm discussed not saying, that for about an hour. So tell me what you, happened when you, you drove off. Saying? Uh, we're, we're not going to make any more progress on that. I get, I get you're pissed about that. And I'm not going to fault you for it. I'm not going to tell you not to be mad. I'm not going to tell you not to feel like, man, that, that was bullshit, but Carp, why'd you do that? If that's the way you feel, gotcha. It's okay. I'm not going to tell you you can't. I'm not going to sit here and tell you how you should or should not feel about how I went about presenting things last night. Mm-hmm. Because I'm about to kill. Okay. But what I've confronted you with and told you today is your mom's car is out here. I've now shown it to you. You know, you want me to, you know tell you all these things no hold on but what i told you from the start and i did tell you this is that part of it's a give and take there's things i'll tell you but i can't just tell you everything we've shown you pictures all right we talked about if the roles were reversed what you want my partner ben yes to do yeah you did say that we talked about that what would you want it to do if it was your kid with the broken leg yeah, the look. yeah that's, so what they that's what they don't want to give it away that he's then killed people so they're like if it was your kid who got <clears throat> the leg broke would we? <laughs> they don't want to give it away like i need for you to tell on yourself like post haste okay 
And then I'll tell you, it's murder. A lot of people did. A lot of people got hurt. Yeah. Oh, yes. Are you serious? Yeah. They really were there. No, I'm saying a lot of people got hurt. Yeah, there's people hurt, man. Like that? Broken legs and stuff like I told you. And ribs and... and, and Cushions, their knives. Headed. Yeah, I wouldn't want to see that happen to nobody, dude. I don't believe you would either. Yeah, yeah but you and just... I'm not saying it's on purpose. <laughs> you just thought... You just thought... Yo, this dude is heartless. So tell us otherwise. You know I didn't I'm say saying? that. I'm it's asking like, you fuck, what man. do you like, want it to be perceived as? Yes. How would you tell like us, us to is, uh, see this? We're wrong, man. It's not heartless. Tell us. Tell us what, what it was. I'm here to listen if it's something different. I'm sitting here. I haven't walked out. Come on, heart. Come on. Y'all know. Y'all know. Listen, man. Y'all know. Y'all know. <laughs> If what I did not talk to that woman, I would never, ever be sitting right here talking to y'all right now. Mm -hmm. I'm not blaming her. Like I told That's so funny that he, I was just about to pause it and go say, look how he, he literally has decided that it is her fault that he drove through the parade. If I wasn't over there talking to that woman. Assaulting that chick. If I wasn't over there just trying to, you know, throw my weight around. If I wasn't over there doing all of that, being all extra, all these people would still be alive today. It's her fault, you see. She made me do it. But I'm not trying to blame her, though. <laughs> I ain't saying it's her fault. I'm just saying that it's her fault. <laughs> I'm not going to demonize that woman. She's a good woman when she's not drinking. Oh, my God. It's not about... Are you serious? <laughs> Daryl. Daryl. You, what you ain't going to do, okay? What you ain't going to do, Daryl, is try to take this conversation back an hour. You're not doing that. Are you trying to act like they ain't just show you these pictures and, and we don't all know what you just done. Now you're going to talk about how she's a good woman when she ain't drinking. Don't nobody give two flying fucks about that. I don't care if she's drunk right now. <laughs> good for her. Good for her. Oh my God. About her anymore, Drew. I know. And I, I believe that she wouldn't be in this position if you hadn't talked to her. I, I believe that. You didn't have to put the picture down. You didn't have to. The stroller. That's a stroller. Yeah. yeah. So a kid got hurt. Yeah. A kid. Yeah. Bad. You said a lot of people got, got hurt. Checked out. Yeah. A lot of people got hurt. Yes. To me, it's a pretty good injury if if a doctor's got to check you out or you got a broken leg. Yeah. A little league baseball boy, baby. Little baby Jackson didn't get a chance to do shit because of this motherfucker. That's what I'm saying. Just like this little piece of tiny little ball of energy and a baseball cap because of this thing and his feelings and his entitlement. Oh my gosh. I hope they get a hold of him. Three times a day. <laughs> yeah, so what do you call my shoulder? <laughs> I'm just making a joke. But... And now he's laughing. Just just that being said, he now, it just, they just showed him a baby stroller and confirmed that kids got hurt. And then he goes right into his joke. Yeah, I don't know. I want to believe you're the man you say you are, girl, but I, I I, I'm not laughing because there's, there's nothing funny about this. No, I was just saying, it's no, it's not. Hair. It's never been this. Dude, I don't take my life as a joke. I don't. Oh. I don't take my life as no joke. I was just making a joke about my shoulder when you just said, you know, if it's mm -hmm. a serious injury, if you got to get looked out. And I was just saying, I had to get looked out, but they didn't say it was serious. They treated it like, oh, Let's say spend the night you're the guy in cuffs, ass. so... Oh my God, this is hard, y'all. This, oh my God, the level, there's levels to this.
the level. I, it's almost unbelievable. It's almost unbelievable that anybody could be this, like, oh my God. You said that part, not me. No, I'm just saying that's how they, not how you acted, that's how they were acting. It's like, oh, well, it's nothing broken. Well, why do I keep having this thriving, burning pain if there's nothing wrong? Where were you going, Darrell? Help us understand. <laughs> you trying to change the subject. <laughs> I can do that. I just want to understand what's. So these parents I know wanna why their kid got hurt just the way you want to know why your kid got hurt. I want to understand what I'm looking at. That's it. Murder. A reckless endangerment. Murder. Yeah, that's something Six you're looking at, right? Murders. Just because some people got hurt. Yeah, people got hurt. I just want to say this. You know that when you said it wasn't the end of the world type thing. Because nothing's the end of the world. It is. Why? Not when you have, not when you have God in your life. It's not. It, it is because <laughs> it's what I believe anyway. I, I believe that too, but you don't want to have God in your life and you're sitting in prison. Can't see your family. Can't see nobody. What, what does? No, the only people who can't see nobody is the people that you just took out <clears throat> with your car. Can't see no. Oh, oh. Oh God. Uh -oh, okay, all right, let's get into the Terminate stuff. I'm already like I'm about to lose my life, man. Can I ask a quick question? Hold on, watch it. I know. Why do you Just want me to watch it? Because I'll show you. I just want you to watch it. Watch it. Why though? Watch it for me. Why though? Because I want you to see what's in the video. Did you watch it? Will you? I just want to know why you want me to watch it. Because I want you to see what's on the video. Why don't you want to watch it? I just want Yeah, why don't you want to watch it? Look at him. I don't want to see that. I saw it already. In in real time. There. I want to know why you want me to watch it. I, didn't say I just it. want you to I see what I told you. Problem. You're not accepting the answer. I told you. I want you to see what's in it. That's why I want you to watch it. You wanted information from us for sure. I want you to watch it and see what's in it. Yeah, it's a good point. It's information sharing. Okay, so I want yeah, you to it's watch like it and see what's to, in it. It's like you, like badgering me, like a little. But Darrell, you asked me a question. Okay, and this is more than what we had before. So I am showing you more. I'm asking you to watch it. Will you watch it? No. I mean, I don't have a problem with. Okay, I just watch. want to know what movies. Reasoning because I want you to see what's in it. I mean, I'm pretty much it's not right. complex, it's just I, you know what I'm no, saying. It's just that I, I want you to see I what happens. I'm here. just saying, I, I already know, I already have an idea from what you guys were saying earlier. But I want so you to like, see it. Ain't it's so? like, watch. He wanted them to be so transparent, just tell me what I'm facing. They're like, okay, here, I'll show you what you're facing. <laughs> here, look, this what it this what happened. happened. Look at it. This is what you're facing. He like, well, I don't understand why you trying to show me what I'm facing, though. <laughs> in my, like, all I'm thinking about right now is here. We'll talk in a what second. What a hell of a journey is been, but this right. is how my story ends. That's all I've been thinking about. Like, it's right. nothing that I want to you look down. Oh, there you go. Why do you want me to see that car? Why? Because I think it's important. Why is it important? Is it to make, like, what is it? Well, why don't you want to look? I just, I'm just asking. I'm not, I'm not trying to raise my voice at you. Or I'm not. I'm just asking you why you don't want to look. I'm just saying, why do you want me to look? So you I think it's important. So you see what happened. You said, you told you me what happened. You. you already told me what happened, girl. Y'all told me what happened. So I understand so my life is over. I'm trying to come to grips with that. Mm -hmm. Yes, come to grips with it. Because it's definitely what's going to happen. <laughs> this is a little bit of foresight for you. You're going underneath the prison for a thousand years. And what you're going to need is a cellmate whose name is Dracula. Because it's the only way you're getting out of this motherfucker. <laughs>
Okay. <laughs> the only way you getting out is if you end up with a cellmate whose name is Dracula. Well, not just name is Dracula. You gotta be Dracula. So he can turn you to a vampire so you can live a thousand years, ergo making it out eventually. That's just it. You in the cold place forever. Okay? This is what's coming for you. You play too many games. <laughs> I'm trying to come to grips with the fact that this is how my story ends. From trying to love somebody, I never see my kids again. My mom, my relationship is gone from me. And it's like... And you took it away. And when you took it away, you also took away six other people. Snatched them right off the planet. Just snatched them. Just snatched. And all you can think about, see this look, all he can think about is what he's losing. While this man is playing this thing and you can, even if you ain't looking at it, Daryl, your big ass ears, you can hear those screams. You can hear them. And all you still can think about is yourself and what you're gonna lose. What is it? What is it to look at and where that's, my life is for me to look at my life in? That's you, Daryl. Is it, is it looking at my life ending? These are the same. I'm just telling you that. Okay? I think it's important you see these. It's important for me to see my life ending. It is important for you to see them. For my life ending. Are we gonna, are we gonna, are we gonna keep going round and round about this or is there something you want to tell me? Nothing's gonna help me at this point. Everybody think, everybody knows what was going on from day y'all knew last night while I was getting investigated, while I was, you know what I'm saying? There's a children right there. See those kids, see that little kid right there? That's right, Daryl. It's over. It's over for you like it was over for them. It's just fair. I know it sucks because you're now going to have to live in that existence. But it's the perspective. You still get to live, right? You still get to live. And it's not like you hadn't already run someone over with your car before that, okay? Let's not forget that part. You have a track record of running people over with your car. You have a track record of running people over with your car. Okay? Because you got away with it the first time, you learned nothing. So you've been getting away with it. And now here you are. No more. You gonna look at it? Oh, so now we have seen it. The full interrogation of Daryl Brooks. And it was gross. Uh, but parts of it were hilarious. Uh, like the phone thing. That is hilarious. <laughs> Y'all behave, because I'm not gonna. Mama love you. Peace.